Welcome to New Life Scientific. You're the tech shop. Today we're going to talk about uh, the Perkin Elmer Lambda 365. A uh, new piece of equipment for us. Um, uh, very nice system. Uh, it's very quick. Once your software is up and, and running, um, they've got a lot of different accessories, uh, chamber accessories that you can order. This is a um, uh, a liquid jacketed cooler or heater, hook it up to a, uh, a circulating bath, put whatever temperature you want, it's going to circulate around your, your cells. Um, there's, a, there's auto samplers, there's sippers, there's all sorts of different accessories available for it. Um, this is one that's gonna be offered on our, um, as, a, as an option for this unit. Uh, it's going to come with a, um, uh, the standard, of course, is the, uh, what they call the single cell, but it is a dual path, just like this one is. Um, they swap out real easy. There's two screws in the front, a little clip, spring clip in the back, slides right out, slides the other one in. So you can change very, very easily. Um, unlike some of the other models where it is very difficult to change, this one looks very easy, and it auto-adjusts to those um, when you change out a feature, it auto adjusts to that. According to literature, we have not had it to do anything other than put this one in and out. Um, uh, the standard model of the software is the UV Express, as I understand it. Uh, a little simpler uh, format as the previous uh, software generation that you may be familiar with. Um, when you first start up, it does a self check of your unit, shows your uh, the pass or fail uh, onto it, and then you're ready to scan. We're in the scan mode, uh, like a lot of the software, uh, the spectrophotometer software, it, each, each section loads separately. Um, each, well, if you want to scan or you want to, uh, the different types of scans you can do, uh, you load a different program. Uh, the Express, they finally made it as a truly separate program. Um, the other, the older version that you may be familiar with um, was the UV Wind Lab, which has separate modules. It still loads the program. It does have a group module. Software works pretty much the same, uh, a little faster. This is the enhanced security version um, of the software. If you do need to enhance security, it is available. Um, other than that, once you're, you're on either side, once you go through your initialization successfully, you're ready to rock. Um, tell it you want to do a sample. If you make a mistake, it'll tell you, hey, click the new first. It assumes that you wanted to do that, told you new. It's a nice feature. Some of them wouldn't be so nice as to do what you, and I go ahead and try the run. We're gonna use that run as a sample. Um, runs fairly quickly. Uh, like I said, just a nice unit. Um, the setups can be run uh, uh, for your different wavelengths. Uh, the default on the scan is a, is a seven to 400 nanometer. Um, uh, scan, once you drop your sample in, you're ready to run. Yeah, so if we want to run a baseline, in this case we're not, we're running a, sa a sample here. Tell it no, click OK, we're ready. It's going to start scanning. Um, as you're going to see by the speed, it's fairly fast. Uh, we're running at, a, uh, at, the, at the normal um, uh, selection rate. Um, uh, you can uh, set it to have for different settings. Again, very easily to do just the pull down menu at the top. So very, uh, very well behaved. Um, a lot easier once you get a run to, uh, to find your peaks and valleys, to get some to your data off. Um, that's the changeover to the, um, to the UV side. And there we get the, the known peaks of a uh, polyam oxide sample and we're done. Um, 
you tell we want to do it to show the automatic um, peaks and valleys. And there we go. Very straightforward, uh, very well behaved software, very stable. Um, when it runs on Windows 10, uh, so it'll pass your uh, uh, IT department's uh, security uh, feature uh, demands. So um, the Lambda 365, great choice for you. Will be available soon. Thank you.